Wine and catch, girl, wine and catch. Me, me, me like to press on it, me like to press on it, press on it. I'm a like to back it so, oh. me like to press on it, I'm a like to back it so. Oh. I just heard it again, girl, them. So now I don't come here. Do you have any fear? We don't have any fear. And God bless me. We ain't smoking at the end. Never jump up a ball like say them can't come here. What the one, one, one to all of my nice and decent people all there, to all of my viewers and subscribers. Thank you very much for coming and visiting me here on Renegade Cool TV. Now, first up, I want to go ahead and talk to you about. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and get right into it. The rapper Little TJ is undergoing emergency surgery after being shot. Has it coming out of a? a Chipotle in Edgewater, New Jersey. As of right now, no other details have been released by the police uh, as far as the investigation, but they said that there was a shooting at an Exxon gas station where um, a victim was shot multiple times and a victim another victim Nobody's was shot once it's unclear whether or not uh little tj was in relation to the shootout or not right now but in the meantime it looks like he is going to be okay at least that's the reports are saying from the hospital he is just went undergone surgery and he is now out right of now and is stable condition and is now in recovery now this is the type of thing that i've been talking about for a while if you go ahead and watch my channel you know exactly what i mean how the gun violence needs to stop now in this case he may live and he may pull through it god bless him on uh, you know prayers out to him and the family and everything like that but at the same time you know hey gun don't stop gun bullet don't stop bullet so we need to go ahead and start coming together you know a young guy like this you know doing this thing i'm i'm making his money and becoming successful and living the dream and then could be gunned down and everything could be over in just an instant on the next top story of today I want to go ahead and talk about Kevon Douglas, otherwise known as Skank Dunn, uh, was recently charged on May 24th for um, behavior of disorderly conduct and uh, um, argument with a security personnel in Norman Manley International Airport in Kingston, which in where he went ahead and pled not guilty. Now, his uh, lawyer, his attorney, um, Mr. Townsend, attorney at law, um, says that he does have a video footage that would um, exonerate his client and prove his innocence. And this has come right after he recently went to Guyana on a Badarishan concert that was held in National Park in Georgetown on May 22nd. Um, where the Minister of Home Affairs in Guyana, Mr. Robson Ben, will not be able to perform in Guyana because of their um, vulgarity and promotion of um, gunshots and gun violence. So they would be prohibited to perform publicly in Guyana. And, um, you know, all holy pop backlash from that, you know, or Andre Ollis jump on him on about, about certain things. Well, anyway, um, so he's like he, he, he pled not guilty and he is said to have to show back up in court in September. So we'll see what happens from there. I'll go ahead and keep you posted. So until next time, I want everybody to live good, be good, and goodbye.